All right, to attach any pieces of clay, we need to use slip. And we do our little scratch and attach technique. Um, first things first, we're gonna create our slip. This is gonna be used as the glue that holds everything together. Um, it's literally just clay and water. So I'm gonna start with some clay and drop it into my water. You can use a finger and just mash it around. You can use a fork and you can help break it up. All we wanna do is mix the clay into the water until it becomes really, really mushy. I'm just breaking it up. The longer it's in there, the softer it's gonna get. And what we're looking for, we don't want it to be watery and gray. We want it to start turning into like a thick, creamy texture. Now, if your slip, as you're using it over time, it starts to dry out and get pasty, we'll just add water to it again. This is starting to become really, really soft clay. Once it turns into really soft clay, it'll, it'll eventually turn into slip. Play now. You'll notice you will make a bit of a mess. If you want to do this in a sink, near a sink, outside, um, whatever works best for you, do that. This is starting to look pretty good. So when you look down in here, you can see that it's quite a bit thicker than water. It's got a lot of clay mixed into it. It can get thicker than this, so it wouldn't be a problem. I would not want it to be much wetter than this. I can keep adding some more in as we go. Um, this is about where it's gonna start working for me. I am happy with that. Um, this is something I like to keep a top on. If you don't keep a top on, it's gonna keep drying out on you. You're gonna have to keep adding water. Um, this small little Tupperware works great. You can use any cup, any container that's going to hold your clay and water. Uh, I believe that's it.